In this video, we're looking at how to find the volumes of cones and pyramids. And we've grouped them together in this same video because they both have basically the same formula. Namely, that their volume is equal to one third times their base area times their vertical height. The only difference between the two is how we calculate the base area. For example, the base of a cone is a circle. So the base area will just be the area of a circle, which we can find by doing pi r squared. And so the symbol formula for a cone would be v equals one third pi r squared h. For pyramids though, the formula for the base depends on what type of a pyramid you have. For example, this pyramid is a square based pyramid. So for the base area, we'd just use the area of a square which is length times length, or length squared. And so this would give us the formula V equals one third L squared H. But if we had a different base, like in this triangle based pyramid, then we'd have to use a different base area. In this case, the area of a triangle. To see how these equations work, let's add some measurements to our shapes and work out their volumes. So if we start with the cone, we're going to have to do one third times pi times our radius squared, so times four squared, and then times the vertical height, which is 10. And so this will give us a volume of 160 over three pi centimeters cubed, if we want our answers in terms of pi, or 168 centimeters cubed, given to three significant figures. Then for the square base pyramid, we just do one third times our length of eight squared times the vertical height of 12. So the volume is 256 centimeters cubed. Anyway, that's everything for this video. So I hope that all made sense. Have a go at the questions on our platform. If you're on YouTube, just click the link in the top right corner to head over. And thanks for watching.